Okay, friends, I'm going to attempt to change my disposal. I bought a new one. It's the same brand as I have. It's just a, a little bit bigger. Well, I'm a little crazy. It should I look like I already changed the disposal? Um, so a new insincorator, and I'm going to attempt to replace it. I watched some YouTube videos. It smells like something died under here. All right, so I'm going to set this camera up, and we're going to attempt to change this. Stay tuned. It stinks, you guys. It stinks. Okay, I had to get one of these, um, I think it's called a socket thing, to loosen the other side and it worked like a charm. So I'm gonna replace this rubber flangey thing that goes around here. So I just wanna make sure that I'm loose from here. I think I am. I'm just gently kind of loosening this up a little bit at a time. I'm gonna reuse the top section up here so I don't want to loosen any of those screws and now the drain has come loose and you just kind of turn this down ta-da okay so I'm gonna use this plug on the new one since it's in like perfect shape and so I got to take this little plate off okay so we're trying to get this plug out right here and it doesn't just pull out. So we're gonna have to try, I tried cutting this with like some tool cutters, but it, it's not enough. So we're gonna Dremel this so that we can get the plug out and reuse it. Okay, success. So we had to cut this out pretty well, but ta-da! Okay, so we got the wires. Now I gotta put the plug back in here. Okay, the rubber mallet worked perfect. I flipped it over and I hammered it in and it is in there super secure. So now let's connect the wires. Okay, I'm gonna flip this up so that I can get the ground on here and tuck these wires in. All right, all nice and neat. Everything's in there. Let's cross our fingers that it all works. Okay, so I opened up the little tool bag that came with it, and I am going to use a new seal on here before I hook that up to my P-trap. So got that in there. Let's go attach this. Okay, so we are ready to reattach this. It's got that new rubber thing already attached to it. I left this in place. It's in good shape. There was no leaks. So I'm leaving that there. And then we've got to lift this up and line it up and make sure that all three edges are, all three little hooks are lined up. This might take a little finagling because I also have the P trap that needs to be attached. Okay. Hardest part, getting this thing lined up and on here, and it freaking weighs a ton. So now that I have it on here, I want to kind of tighten this up. So I'm putting a screwdriver in to just slowly just inch it along. I want to turn this a little bit so I can line it up and get this connected. All right, just tightening up the last thing. There we go, tight. Check this side. Tight. I'm going to turn on the water first and check for any leaks. We'll put this under here just in case. Okay, looks good. No leaks. Okay, so I'm almost done. I plugged back in, and let me show you. If I hit the disposal with the water, nothing. It's not working, but if I take it out of this adapter, then it works. So I'm not quite sure what the adapter is for, but if I take it out of the adapter and I plug it in, 
there it goes. You can hear it. But I can't turn it off. So Todd helped me and uh, I needed to put this little tube back in this box and that makes it work. So watch. We did it, folks. We did it. We did it. Yay. New disposal. <sighs> okay. <laughs> it, was a, it was a little hectic. It was a little frazzling in here. All right, now let me clean and put everything back under the sink. Have a great day.